Alrighty guys, welcome back to Surviving Mars. I believe this is episode 4, so if you enjoy, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit every button you guys can hit. We're trying to bring back the glory days of YouTube one day at a time, as you guys know. So, in the last video we started building this dome here, micro dome, because we wanted to get a school and maybe a Martian University online. Now, as you guys know, Martian Universities cannot get them yet, have to get down the social tree more. So we are waiting for research to happen. So basically, I'm thinking we need a research dome. <sighs> That's gonna be a problem though, because we need a research dome to be something like this, maybe. Because I'm gonna have 25% research boost. Um, let's see here. Can I get like. So that is 25%. That is 25%. I didn't do all 25% if I. Oh, wait, if I did this too, 25%. Hold on, wait. Aren't these like 15? 15. Research and complete. 10 minus 25. 15. Oh, so I already need to cross it. Okay. So that is done. Now we have low G turbines. Oh, that's good, because that allows, I believe, yeah, to increase production by 33%. That is good, and then we're going to do schematic training currently, which increased botanist and scientist performance by 10%. So that is good. How much Sector longer do we have founders Anomaly for? Like, found. if the game we have founders any more? Resources are low. Like, do we have founders? We do. I think, though, we either uh, lasted the founders, or the game has glitched, and I don't think we have a founder period. Let me see here. Do we have a founder period? No, I can just ask for more. I think I can go to the game with the founder period, that's fine. We're low on food. Um, how long are yours gonna be? Uh, we won't be in a few seconds. It's fine. Um, okay, so we're basically just waiting for these guys to finish up here. Once they finish up here, we can put in a school, which I believe is electronics. Yeah, six of them. No, uh, not that many. Research stations cost like electronics and stuff. So what we're gonna have to do is build a passage from about here, from like right here. Oh, that doesn't work. Huh. Okay, so I placed this in the wrong spot then. I do that because then we can get a passage right here to allow to allow here. So and then we can do that. There we go. Okay. So that is that. Now, if you could grab a bow, all of that. That'd be great. And then if you could just bring that to about right here. That'd be good. Thank you. Alright. So now they're going to make this, because now they have the metal to do so. Just had to bring it over. And we have our first microdome being built up. There it is. Our first microdome. Sweet, okay. So now technically, in theory, we could build a passage from here. To 
here. In theory, of course. Um, it's kind of... Passages in this game are kind of finicky. Um, so we'll see how it works. But in theory, I should be able to connect these two via water and power. We have to call in another... Any day now, game. So, guys, I believe today you'll probably be seeing me play a lot of Destiny on the channel because you know Souls of the Heroes just came out, so I'm gonna probably cover that on the channel now. I'm gonna be probably be covering Solstice on the channel because that, of course, is a big, you know, a big thing on my channel is Destiny. So I think we're gonna be covering Solstice. Building a new home on an alien world. That takes guts, to say the least. Here's the exhausted trait. Um, okay, bud. Um. Okay, bud. So he's exhausted. See, the thing is, guys, once you finish, you know, your first harvest, we should be fine. It's just the first harvest needs to happen. How much are we getting off this? Oh, it's concrete. Oh, okay. So putting in concrete. They got a harvest. My harvest just finished. Meanwhile, they're making a passage so they can get from dome to dome. There we are. I think we got a passage, guys. Meanwhile, they're also having to fix food up. Because we have a good amount of food. Um, the diners are working fine, and uh, Loji, uh, I believe these, the, the gyms are working fine. There's no one in the gym currently. People are using the gym. Oh, there it is. The passage is to watch. You're going to see this become like full on. Ready? Sector scanned. Red medals! So we need it. So we need it right there, guys. There it is. Boom. See, if you see it come online. So, now this dome is, of course, going to be our school dome for these guys. So, we're going to add in this. However, I just realized we've been using a lot of electronics in here. So, they're probably. We, I think we need to call in another uh, thing, but they're going to. Because they're going to make the money back I call in here, I believe. So I'm. What I need is. Anomaly found. Problem is I need this. Research complete. It's good, thank you. Uh, do what do we have next? Ah, oh, dang it, we're not getting. Uh, I want it. I, I really want them to give us. Um. More Martian African Star Trek. Yes! Need this. We need this right here. We need that. We need that. But. I'm trying to go through it all and eventually get there. Um, so we're currently getting stuff for moisture evaporators. Okay, so where did we find resources? Where are did low. we find rare metals? Show me. Where did I, where did you guys find rare metals? I can see you guys found them. So where did you? You found rare metals here? What? You you did. You legit did. Nice. Oh, it's high as well. Oh, that's good. That's good. It's a high grade. High grade metal deposit. Okay, okay, okay. And then we also found an anomaly. Please come over here and scan this for me. Uh, we also have one right over here. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. Okay, how are you guys keeping up with water and power? It should be fine because just buy more power. Um, okay, so in terms of everything, this guy kind of needs to launch back off. Problem is he's getting loaded up very slowly. I wanted to pump him up, but he he should be fine uh, eventually. Um, so yeah. But guys, we have our metals now, so now we can make a uh, mining dome, which is good because we need a mining dome. Breakthrough discovered. Oh, that's good. What is it? It's not the one I want. 20 colonists during all 20 colonists can 20 performance during night shifts. Yes, 
Please, I, I, I need that. Um, actually, I kind of like this to be done right now, please, because it's further up on the list. So please do that. That'd be great. Thank you. Okay. And then there is also another one, I believe, right here for you to discover. Thank you. That would that would be great. All right. Start scanning in here, please. There you go. Okay, how are you doing? You're doing fine. They're loading him slowly, but they're also loading him, you can tell. They're loading him with fuel. fuel currently, fuel is being loaded in. Some metal is going up now. There's now some metal going in. Eventually, he'll just launch, and I'll be able to call. I can call on a rocket probably right now, actually, for our cargo that we need. So we need more polymer, about 20, 20, and 20 is what I'm going to take. 20, 20, and 20. Send that, please. Thank you. This guy should be launched by the time he gets there, otherwise they can just work with him. That was good though guys, we found rare metals, that's what we needed. We needed, and we got a high rare metal deposit as well. Alongside a metal deposit, which is high. So we have money down basically. There's more to the back. So we have new techs. I've never seen this tech. Oh, fungal farm, right. Right, that produces food, but not great food. And we have that one. All right, so they are now at nine percent on that research. That's good. So I think we're gonna go with a mining dome, then a research dome, guys. So today we're probably gonna make another dome. I think once this guy launches, I can get more materials and make more domes. I want you guys to please fill him up faster, because actually, you know, the rocket's at twenty-eight percent coming in. So we're, you guys are fine currently, but if you guys can move a little bit faster, loading this thing. Okay, you're gonna do one more fuel. And then you guys just need to load the metal into it. Now you guys just need to load 10 metal in, which we have, yes. Um, I should probably. Okay, I'm gonna load that there. So I don't forget their stuff in it. Okay, yes. okay, he's in the launch like 10 sites. Okay, cool. So, any more anomalies nearby? Nope. No more anomalies that we can find, at least. Alright, so, guys, this is going to be our little um, uh, thing for the time being. Um, we're going to eventually branch out into down here, but we're going to need tunnels for that. If you want to go down any of these slopes, well, I guess we might as well go down and on that slope, but we really need tunnels to go down slopes, so... That's gonna cost a lot of machine parts. I believe they cost like 300, like 30 machine parts. Yeah, they cost like 30 machine parts, and it's like so many machine parts. This might honestly be where I put a, where I put the dome on this vista. I might put the like the mine dome on this vista. So yeah. Okay, you're producing at 1% less than what you should be. That's fine. Sector Sweet. scanned. See ya. Have fun on your journey. Is he gonna come back? Or did I just wait, wait for a rocket? Ah, two big four souls for him to do it. Alright, good job. Have fun with that. You guys do this work. You guys get to work. Um, so now we're going to set up this dome. So, we want a playground to be here, and then we want a school to be there. And that is pretty much it for now. If you guys can make the playground in the school, that would be nice. Just start setting up. That is because the playground will help kids just kind of. Uh, playgrounds here. They cultivate children's perks. So we're just going to make a children dome here and then we're going to make a Washington University 
and this is probably gonna be a flu area. Because now we're gonna cultivate traits in the students, basically. We're gonna put traits in the students, which is gonna be good. So, how long do you have? You have a three hour. I think we'll wait for that guy to come back in the morning of the episode, probably. Yeah. Alright, so we now have a Martian's QO eventually. One day. One day. Once you guys bring one more machine. Watch out. Oh, there it is. There they are. They also. Oh, it's gonna make this sweet. Playground and a school open for business. So now the playground is open for business, and now the school is open for business. We should immediately get kids in here, correct? Or do I have to. Do I have to say they can use the passages for work? Do they know they can? They know they can. So, technically, I can just go into children. We got two of you currently. Please go there. Oh, then they miss a home. They're missing a home. Oh, okay. So, I do need to build the nursery. Okay. So the nursery goes here. Dome Commander? What do you mean two parts of You mean two parts of Dome Commander? It's a rough life here on Mars. You can... Okay, now for the traits. I'm gonna, uh, so w the one I always use, I always usually take away nerd, because nerd is not a great perk, and I usually put in religious. Uh, because then Sandy never thinks of suicide, and then we don't never ever like suicides. So, yes. There we go. And these kids are also... Cultivates perks to special... Movement um, return program. So these children are gonna basically do this. Can they use this dome? So, I, I don't understand. It says they can technically use passages for work. Correct? So, why can't they use... So, tell me something. If I were to say... You, buddy. You right here. Can you just come here and, uh... Train... Can you just come here and train here? Or... Yeah, there you go. Workplace to school. And... Nursery. So, now you... Live to school and you're at that nursery. Yeah, so you are what's your name? You Sector are, scanned. You are name, please. Uh you yeah, you are Mars Cos Mars Cosmos. So is Mars Cosmos going to the school? Is that I understand the school is a lot of places. I could actually shut it down for a whole day. Like, I should shut it down for a whole shift, because no one goes to the end of that shift, so I could probably shut it down for that shift. I don't think I want that school anyway, just because, you know, sanity. Um, they're 53% done. L literally, they're 53% done. With their expedition to get us $2 million, which is good, because then we'll be back, back up to $5 million. Five billion, and that would mean that then we would look good so actually I want to see something can I set your resources are low power is low really come on so if I were to set your residence here would you still you would yeah so now I, I don't need this yeah yeah I don't need this okay cool so 
They're gonna play at the playground. Yeah, so they're gonna play the for the everyone's gonna play at the playground and they're gonna come to school here. That is good. Now, in terms of the power situation, how are the well you guys aren't keeping up at all. You're recharging during the day. Okay, I'm gonna add another solar panel and another because especially when we get a Martian University, there's gonna be one more big power bump and that's gonna be Martian University for at least this power station. I'm probably gonna make a whole new power station for when we make this area because I'm not gonna run on the same power. So yeah. Please uh, make that for me. But we currently have no one going here, but we have people oh we have one person going there. Do we have a graduate? We have a graduate! Yes, nice. So they don't have the rigorous traits. Nice, so they don't have those traits. Problem is they're no spec. So you're gonna find a no spec living in here. Well, there are many no specs. Actually, now you go. There are many no specs actually. This guy is gonna take another another soul holy to finish up. But this we actually look decent and now we're creating 19 external power. Yep. Now we're creating 19 more power than what we need. So these guys should be charging like exponentially they are. Okay. Good. Uh polymer that for me please. Oh, do you guys have all the polymer over here? Yeah, it's only three. We should have polymer over there to fix that up. Fix that up, guys. That's good. So, I think, guys, one unemployed, it's fine. Um, so, I think, guys, that, oh, we have another kid. Did we just get another birth? We got another birth. So, I think we are really doing well now. So, I set up our school dome, which we're going to have to add one more thing, which is the Marshall University, to diversify them into different forms, because we don't want no specs forever. Uh, currently, though, we cannot make a Martian University, um, because I can show you guys where it is in research. So it's in the social part of research here, and currently I'm not even researching anything in social research. So, yeah. We can get a one-time grant of funding, and, uh, yeah, we're going to have to go down a lot to find that. It's probably going to be, like, right here, honestly, but, yeah, I think we're actually going to get something for soil adaption, which is nice. Uh, eventually we're gonna get the big, that's the fungal farm, but eventually we're gonna get the big farms, which are the best farms in the game. Uh, currently we're just using these farms, and they're using less water than we need. Uh, okay. Uh, are you guys able to fix that? You are. Okay, good, you are. Okay, good. Okay, just making sure that you want you to have to, like, you know, do that with the dome. There's one person there, and then there is two in school learning. So I think I'm the one thing I'm gonna do though is I'm gonna shut down the night shift of the school because no one's ever gonna go there. Research nice. complete. Milestone achieved. Nice. We got a breakthrough, and that is colonists gain performance during night shifts. And now give me that money. Thank you. All right. Now we are actually doing pretty good, and this guy is gonna come back in about 13 hours, so he'll come back and play at night. But guys, I think we have made a self-sustaining dome. So we've got a lot of people working at the space bar. A lot of people, we have some people working in the medical checks, because medical checks basically are what gives us nurseries and more people living in the dome. Now eventually it's gonna overflow and I'm scared for that when that moment happens, but I believe people are gonna die before it overflows. So I think we're fine in that sense. But for now, we have a kid's dome set up and we are gonna make a Martian University right here. To allow for that kid's dome to be taught. Allow for these kids and these no specs to be taught their proper profession for this dome. Which I would probably go for six medics first. I, I'm probably gonna do go for medics first to get the med checks perfect and to get them working better in the med checks area. And eventually, um, I'm gonna place a water reclaimer here because then we can use more no specs. But for Sector now, scanned. um, these guys don't use that much water. I don't think. No, they're using like three water. So for now, I don't need a water reclaimer up. 
and running. They are 100% done. And they are returning. We've hopefully gotten the money for that. Yeah, we did. We have 5,000 left. Nice. So they are going to return from the project. Either they return to Earth or they return here. That's what I wonder now. So that's good. But now that we have that, to see if the kids are just walking through the through this and into their dome, which is nice. Meteor shower oh. incoming. That's gonna be fun. So it's gonna be uh, it's in six and four hours. That's fine on me. Um, they have to land. Why do you have to land? Land here. Come on down, bud. Here he is. He has landed. Alright, load him up with fuel for me. Load him up with fuel, and he might go back on another expedition, honestly. Let's, because now we... Oh, God. So that's a breakthrough. That's new technology. I don't need that. I would like some money, so what will give me money? This will make outcome research. See, eventually when we get down to when we can waste materials like that, I'm going to do all this stuff, but for now I'm just going to hand pick stuff. So, geologist and breakthrough. Okay, that's going to be... When we get the uh, digging dome set up, we can send that, um, send that. They're going to capture meteors down here, which gives me what? Trigger a meteor shower that yields some valuable resources, metals, rare metals, and anomalies. The meteor shower will fall in a random location and may threaten the colony. So we're going to trigger a meteor shower to maybe give us rare metals. And then there's this place here. Which is going to give us the breakthrough and then that's it. So we don't have any more money uh, expeditions for now. So I think we're just going to send that guy back. But we do have a lot of breakthroughs that we can get through. So that'll be fun. For now, however, I think that we're done with this video, guys. So what we did today was we made a kid's dome. We made a functioning kids dome somehow. I've never done this. I've never made a functioning kids dome. Uh, we're engraving traits on kids through a playground and a school, which is making them happy and ready for their next, for their lives. The meteor dome is going to last three souls. Of course it is. So, where's it landing? I don't see anything. All right. So, um, by the way, guys, once we make the next dome, we're going to grab from this water. Actually, no, that's a 9,000 water. How much water do we have left here? That's the same. Okay, so we're going to make a... So, guys, in the next video, we probably will make a dome right here. And we will probably grab the rare metals and metals. So, so if I can, I'll probably do this. So I can grab rare metals and metals and give them a 10 percent comfort boost that will be a good idea so that'll be what we do we'll also make a new power system for that dome and hopefully we will get a martian university soon because that is what we need guys we need martian university because once we get a martian university guys everything just starts happening because then our kids become engraved with different traits such as medics security guards uh, and everything so yeah, guys, basically, I think we are done for the day. Um, if you have enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe. Uh, do it. If you have enjoyed the... Oh, my God. Sorry, I had a burp. Um, if you have enjoyed this video, guys, uh, please like, subscribe, comment. Has it been recording this whole time? Or have I just been, like, talking to a wall? No one has been recording. All right, so... <laughs> If you have liked this video, please like, comment, subscribe, do everything you guys do, and I will see you guys next time. See you guys.